Get Biblical Understanding, along with T.A. McMahon. Wisdom is the principal thing, therefore get wisdom. And with all I getting, get understanding. Proverbs chapter 4, verse 7. This is number 174 in our series of Get Biblical Understanding. In this session, we're reading many, but certainly not all, of the biblical verses that have to do with children. The Bible makes wonderful statements regarding children. Perhaps the greatest of these is how we become the children of God. For ye are all the children of God by faith in Christ Jesus. Additionally, we find many childlike attributes that our Lord desires in all those who would come to him. Again, the theme of this series is children. Matthew chapter 21, verses 15 to 16. And when the chief priests and scribes saw the wonderful things that he did, and the children crying in the temple and saying, Hosanna to the son of David, they were sore displeased, and said unto him, Hearest thou what these say? And Jesus said unto them, Yea, have ye never read, Out of the mouth of babes and sucklings thou hast perfected praise? Mark chapter 5, verses 22 to 24. And behold, there cometh one of the rulers of the synagogue, Jairus by name. And when he saw him, he fell at his feet, and besought him greatly, saying, My little daughter lieth at the point of death. I pray thee, come and lay thy hands on her that she may be healed, and she shall live. And Jesus went with him, and much people followed him and thronged him. Mark chapter 5, verses 39 to 42. And when he was come in, he saith unto them, Why make ye this ado, and weep? The damsel is not dead, but sleepeth. And they laughed him to scorn. But when he had put them all out, He taketh the father and the mother of the damsel, and them that were with him, and entereth in where the damsel was lying. And he took the damsel by the hand, and said unto her, Talitha kumi, which is being interpreted, Damsel, I say unto thee, Arise. And straightway the damsel arose, and walked. For she was of the age of twelve years, and they were astonished with a great astonishment. Mark chapter 7, verse 25. For a certain woman, whose young daughter had an unclean spirit, heard of him, and came and fell at his feet, gone out, and her daughter laid upon the bed. Mark chapter 9, verse 17. And one of the multitude answered and said, Master, I have brought unto thee my son, which hath a dumb spirit. Mark chapter 9, verses 21 to 22. And he asked his father, How long is it ago since this came unto him? And he said, Of a child. And oft times it has cast him into the fire and into the waters to destroy him. But if thou canst do anything, have compassion on us and help us. Mark chapter 9, verse 24. And straightway the father of the child cried out and said with tears, Lord, I believe. Help thou mine unbelief. Thanks for listening, and we hope you'll join us again as we search the scriptures in order to get biblical understanding.